What up guys, Eric here from Racing Ram Fam, and in today's video, guys, we're going to be showing you my 1986 F700 toter home that we have sitting right behind us. So this is our new tow pig to, of course, haul our 24-foot enclosed trailer. So we did pick up this truck, this big old truck. It is a 1986 F700, as you can see the badging right there. And the tires are huge. It makes my truck and everything else look puny around it. Uh, it does have a gooseneck and a trailer hitch. So you can haul everything you can imagine. So we trailer hitch, gooseneck, uh, big white sides. Um, it is a total motorhome, so we can open the door right here and take a little walk in. So we got some steps, empties, walk in. We got, it is straight out of the 80s, of course, 90s. Interior vibes, even the smell is too, if you guys can smell it. So we got a table, chairs, we got a fridge, we got a microwave, we got a air vent for if we had like a stove top or something right here. Uh, another bed above the cab, it is a 5 speed, actually it's a 10 speed manual, it's a 5 speed manual with a 2 speed rear end, so it's a 10 speed. Um, it has the 8.2 liter Detroit diesel, we'll talk about that more when we go under the hood. Um, it is old school, it's got about 220,000 miles on it, but it does have a newer motor in it. Um, she is pretty old, but it works good for what we need. Uh, heating, air conditioning up here, of course, and then our bathroom is right here. Sneak in here with the shower, turn the light on for you guys. So we got a shower, toilet, sink, uh, vanity mirror, little vent. But yeah, that's about the toter. It's not the biggest thing on the inside, but it's going to work for what we need, and it should have all the power in the world to haul that 24 foot enclosed trailer. Pop down, let's pop the hood open for you guys. Big old latches, big F700. So you, if you guys remember back about a year ago, we did own a F600, but that had a 7.3 swapped into it. This actually comes with factory with the 8.2 liter Detroit diesel in it. And there she is, the big old 8.2 liter turbo diesel Detroit we have sitting right there. You can see remanufactured engine, chilling right there, new alternator, bunch of new parts. She runs really good, and we'll start her up for you guys in a little bit here. Uh, we are going to be doing an oil change and fuel filters. You'll probably see that in another video on how we do that in this big old girl behemoth of a machine. But the trailer is ready to go. The truck is probably ready to go. This truck just needs a little work. We're gonna be doing front brakes. Again, some TLC maintenance to it. And some other things, it runs really good. Uh, doesn't have all the power in the world. It only makes 500 foot-pounds of torque, but it gets like 13 miles to the gallon, so you can't beat that. Again, here's a better interior pick. So, five-speed manual, two-speed rear end, so it's a 10-speed. The ether cold start, that's how old it is. <laughs> Shoot a little starting fluid in there before firing it up. But yeah guys, that's the toter. We're gonna fire them up, let you guys hear them sound like. A little smoky, but she is old. I mean, mechanical injection, she's gonna be a little smoky when she's cold. But, it does run really well. And it's really quiet as well. It doesn't have like any blow by at all on the motor. Nothing. So, can't complain about it. Uh, she's definitely gonna do what we need her to do. A little outdated, but it should work good for hauling the race truck and everything else we need. So guys, I hope you like this little video of our new toter home, our 86 F7 Hundo. Uh, as always guys, hit that subscribe button because we always got awesome videos coming. I hope you guys like this video. Comment down below what you think of our new toter home to haul our race trucks and to go racing itself. But as always guys, keep it boosted and we'll see you in the next one. Peace!